Hi, thanks for joining me today. Today I want to share with you a really simple project that is a great one to have in your arsenal. I use this project all the time. And that is how to make a little mini gift bag out of an envelope. And you only need three things to do this project. You need a scoring board. This is my Simply Scored tool from Stampin' Up. Some dry adhesive and just a plain standard envelope. Now the size of the envelope that you choose is going to um, determine how big your, your finished uh, bag is going to be. This is just a standard A2 envelope from Stampin' Up. It fits a, a four and a quarter by five and a half card. So the first thing that you want to do is seal up your envelope and of course you can just lick it and close it if you want. I do like to use my dry adhesive and I'm going to get it as close to the edge as I can. And I'm just going to put the adhesive around the three sides of the flap. Now you don't want to get adhesive in this area here because then it's going to stick to, you know, it's going to stick this part shut. So you want to make sure that you get it close to the edge and then you're just going to go ahead and seal that closed. So now I'm going to bring my Simply Scored tool back in. And this is also what comes into play in terms of determining the size of your finished bag. You're going to take whatever measurement you like and you're going to score at that measurement on three of the four sides of your envelope. So you can do, um, play around with the measurements a little bit and, and kind of get a feel for what you like the size to be, also depending upon what you want to put inside the bag. I am going to score mine at three quarters of an inch. And remember, you want to do the same measurement on three sides of your envelope. Oops. So there's one. There's my second side. And there is my third side scored at three quarters of an inch. Now we're all done with our scoring tool. And now what you want to do is on, I hope you can kind of see where I scored, on the two long sides and um, one of the short sides. So uh, make sure when you're choosing your three sides um, that those that you choose the two long sides and one of the short sides. Um, and then what you want to do is take this um, and cut off just a tiny little sliver on the short side that you did not score on. You can do, um, you, you can put it in your paper trimmer and do it that way. You can um, use your scissors and just cut a little slit or you can use uh, an edge punch if you want to create a little decorative edge. I'm just going to take this to my trimmer and just cut a tiny little sliver off of this side of the envelope. And that is so you can see now the envelope will open up. So that, that, that'll be the top of our bag. Now if you wanted to do any stamping on the bag itself, now is the time to do it before you start um, putting the bag together. You want to do it while the envelope is still flat. But I'm just going to go ahead and show you uh, how to put the whole project together. So you just want to get a good crease with your bone folder on your three score lines and I like to fold it and crease it backwards and forwards to get a good fold. Let's go this way first. And you just want to do that on, oops, on all three of your score lines. Just make sure you get a nice crisp fold. Okay. Now you just kind of stick your hand down into the bag, or the envelope, excuse me, and you're going to work on the side folds here. I'm just kind of folding 
the side in. Don't worry too much about the bottom right now. So you see how I just folded that in on itself? Kind of like the side of a gift bag. And then we'll do this other side here. Just fold it in on itself. And then you can kind of go and shape the bottom here. And you're gonna see when you flatten out the bottom, you have these two little tabs on the side, and those are gonna fold to the bottom of the bag. And there you can see that it's starting to look like a bag. Just make sure you get those creases folded where you want them to be. And I'm just gonna take two little pieces of score tape. You can kind of see what I'm doing here. And I'm just going to place the score tape on the inside of each of these little tabs, okay? You can remove the backing. And then you're just gonna fold these two tabs in. And they might not wanna stick really well right away. So what I like to do is put the bag flat on my desk and use a bone folder or a pen or a pencil or something just to go in there and make sure that those tabs are really stuck down well to the bottom of the bag. And there you have it, a cute little gift bag made out of an envelope. And of course you can go ahead and decorate this however you like. You can fold down the top or you can punch some holes and tie a ribbon or some twine through absolutely whatever you like so i hope that you enjoyed this technique and i um hope you give it a try i can't wait to see what you do with it thanks for joining me